Welcome back guys to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan. Talking a little quiet tonight because uh, I already have my wife asleep, so I kinda gotta keep my voice a little low. But I wanted to make this video because I don't wanna let this idea or theory slip away. So coming up, March 10th is Scream 6. I know I say that every video, we're super excited. I cannot wait for the video, uh, sorry, for the movie, just like you guys. Again, if you haven't seen, congratulations to T. He um, won the tickets for the giveaway, but don't be discouraged. There's gonna be more giveaways to come later on in the future. But okay, let's talk about this picture on the screen. Now, something interesting. During one of the TV spotlights for Scream 6, there was a picture, I'll put it up on the screen, about uh, news that their McKenzie family had been murdered. Now, if you actually have been following a lot of Scream 6 news lately, and you just know of Scream itself. Now, let's go back to Scream 5 for a minute. Scream 5, Liv was a McKenzie, okay? We know that she died, right? Um, Amber shot her in the head or whatever. So she's dead. Now, let's go all the way back to Scream 1. Remember in Scream 1, after Billy and Stu had broken into the house, they killed Casey, or killing Casey, whatever, uh, the dad walked in, he said, he told the mom, get in the car, drive down to the McKenzie's. Okay, stay with me, bear with me here, I kind of have a theory. I think this Scream 6 movie is going to be a plot to clean up and basically... Because the McKenzie's family has been ruined, which is Samir Weaving, I believe she's going to be a McKenzie, and I think she's going to be one of the killers. I also think she's going to be the opening scene, and the. Key. I think they're going to fake her out, basically. I think that they're going to make her die in the beginning of the movie, or fake death, and then she's going to actually turn out to be one of the killers, just like Roman. Now hear me out <laughs> I think the plot is going to be basically they're gonna make they're gonna blame she's going to blame Sam for Billy her being Billy her father for starting all the murders and she's gonna want to clean up and basically take revenge on the Mackenzie's name because her obviously right they were targeting family members of the original movie of Scream 1, which Mackenzie live, and I think Samira is going to get revenge and try to clean up and basically get revenge on Sam for what Billy had done in the past. Maybe not. Maybe this is just a stupid theory and it has you know, nothing to do, but I think we're on to something here. Because you'll notice by the picture I put up on the screen, there was news that there was a Mackenzie family murdered. So I think this is going to tie in to a true crime murder, right? This is going to be someone who studies Ghostface, who knows the past killings, who knows the history of all the ghost faces and why, what's happening. And I think this is going to be like a sad story because if you follow viewer Anon on Twitter, he's a major leaker for Scream. He basically talks about that this is not going to be a fun uh, ending for Scream 6, like the, the 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 killers reveal and like why they're doing everything. It's not a fun plot. So I'm interested to see how this is going to turn out. All right. So I could be completely wrong. You know, we're not going to know until the movie drops on March 10th. But I think that this could be a revenge story for the McKenzie family. I think Samir is going to end up being a McKenzie. You know, Liv was a McKenzie in Scream 5. We know back in Scream 1, the McKenzie's were um, neighbors to the Beckers, Casey Becker, who died in the beginning. So I think this is going to be a, not like a do-over, but like a, just a revenge and kind of clean and clear up the McKenzie name. Like, you know what, this happened to my family because of you, so we're going to take it out on you and basically try to kill you and get revenge on the Loomises, or whatever you want to say, you know. But anyways, guys, this is just my thoughts, my theories. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Please put your comments down below. Let me know what you think of my theories. 
Uh, if you like this video, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys on the next screen video. Take care.